lot of Joni Mitchell songs. I always felt like Joni was sacred. I mean, unless you could do it as good as her, then you shouldn't do it at all. And, um, which didn't mean it had to be like her, like a Andy's yeah. version of Woodstock, right? Yeah. Um, I got over that. Now I sing, I don't care what it sounds like. You sound wonderful. Thank you. I really, I really wasn't fishing. This is a song that I, I actually haven't done in many years, but when I used to, when I lived in Brooklyn and I played out um, them, this is part of my repertoire. But I always played it, so it's interesting singing it and not accompanying myself. So the thing with the tunings is that Joni used a different tuning on almost every song. She completely retuned the guitar for every song, and she thought about how it would sound and what she heard in her head. And part of it was because she had a little trouble with her fingers. She had polio when she was very young. And one of the things that she had difficulty with was certain voicings on the guitar and standard tuning. So she just rearranged the guitar to match her fingers, which was brilliant, actually. And it also gave her these really amazing tones that she got out of the guitar that were unusual and different. And when I was younger, I used to try to play Joni's songs. I didn't realize she was in different tuning. So I would be like, OK. <laughs> like Joni, but she, you, you all know she played her guitar left-handed, but she didn't string it differently. She just turned the guitar over. <laughs> she didn't, you know, she, I mean, who knew? So, uh, I and mean, she played all her songs like that, so it's, it's amazing what you can work with. So if you, if you watch my fingers, you'll notice that a lot of times I'm just using one finger and barring the guitar. They got a lot of style, they got stamps in many countries They got passports, are so friendly Some are cutting, some are watching it from the wind Some are standing in the center 